people, t I think, uh, have tended to view climate change as something that happens uh, somewhere else, you know, to other people far away from us. And also, you know, not now, you know, maybe some distant point in the future. Well, uh, more and more we're realizing that it is happening uh, right now and also uh, in, uh, impacts us as well as people on the other side of the world. People need to feel they can make a difference. So you can perceive all the threat in the world and you can feel very, very scared about something. But you're not going to act if you don't feel that you or, or the people around you or your country can do anything about it. So that, that perception of efficacy, that perception of being able to do something is important too. The music can go from sadness to joy and give you that sense of movement or progress. And this could be important, trigger a, a trajectory of hope. We have the warnings now, now we need action. And music uh, motivates action. You've got to catch, capture people's attention in the first place. So I think music can do that in different ways. One of the big things about, about tempo, as I see it, is educating musicians, teaching musicians about how the human mind works, how you know music, emotion, affect, that faint whisper of emotion can all be, be, be key in motivating um, these actions. The, the musicians already know a lot about you know, the power they have to, uh, to move audiences. I mean, they go out there in front of an audience and, and they get them all <laughs> charged up and exciting and, they, and, they're, and the audience is jumping up and down and cheering. And the only thing that I would tell them is, you've got great power uh, and, and we need you to use that power uh, to, to motivate action because we're not acting. And if we wait much longer, it'll be too late. It can allow people to engage in the feeling and it can be participatory as well. Um, it's not just about watching. That gives you a sense of belonging, that sense of collective. You know, music certainly creates energy. And of course, we need that energy and that strength to, uh, you know, to act and hopefully do important things.